Broadcast standard is a system of encoding of video signal for its direct on-air transmission. In the times of black and white television, there were several unrelated systems that differed in the number of lines, frame rate and other parameters. The transition to color television multiplied the number of the systems even more, as signals of different color encoding schemes superimposed on the various transmission systems of black and white images. Nowadays, the basic standards are CCAM, PAL and NTSC. However, it should be noted that in recent years new standards have been introduced – digital television and high-definition television. Despite rather significant differences, there are several basic parameters for transmission of television images. One of the first of these is the number of lines. The more lines there are, the more information on the screen is shown, and the higher definition and image quality is. On the other hand, the greater the number of lines is, the greater should be the frequency band used for transmission, and correspondingly fewer channels can be created. In fact, only two standards are used, the European one with 625 lines, although 575 lines are actually shown, and the American one with 525 lines, approximately 480 lines are shown. The next parameter is the frame rate. In most TV sets, frames are shown with the same frequency as they are transmitted. At the same time, frame deflection frequency is twice the frame rate, because of the use of interlacing. Frame deflection frequency is also of two types, the European one with a frequency of 50 Hz and the American one with the 60 Hz frequency. And finally, the third parameter is the aspect ratio. All the old systems have the 4 by 3 height and width of the frame ratio, which corresponds to the initial format of a TV frame. However, since the late 90s and the beginning of the spread of flat panel TVs, the PAL Plus system with aspect ratio of 16 by 9 became widely spread.